A computer or laptop has basically two types of memory. These are the RAM and ROM. RAM, which stands for Random Access Memory, is one of the most important component in determining your system's performance. It offers a place to store and access data temporarily, only when connected to power. On the other hand, ROM stands for Read-Only Memory. It is a storage medium that stores information permanently, and they are designed so that if the device loses power, the drive does not lose what is in its memory. SSDs and HDDs are a special type of ROM called EEPROM, which stands for Electrically Erasable and Programmable Read-Only Memory. This means you can read and write, and the information is hold even if the device is powered down. Today we are going to look at the difference between hard drives and solid-state drives. Starting with the hard drives, this is a drive which contains magnetic disks where the data is stored on in the form of ones and zeros. These hard drives have been around since 1956 since they were introduced by IBM. Their magnetic disks rotate at high speeds. In this process, the actuator arm reads or writes data according to the instructions it is given by the user. The magnetic disks have three common speeds of rotation which can either be 5,400 RPM, 7,200 RPM, or 10,000 RPM. Laptops hard drives operate at 5,400 RPM. Most desktop computers operate at 7,200 RPM, and servers and high-end computers operate at 10,000 RPM. These HDDs come in two different sizes, which can either be 3.5 inch, mostly for desktops, or 2.5 inch, which is made for laptops. The other type of storage device is the SSD, which stands for Solid State Drive. They store data using flash-based memory and therefore they do not have any moving parts. They have come to replace HDDs because they are up to 500 times faster and are quiet in operation. Today, almost all new laptops use SSDs for non-volatile data storage. Furthermore, SSDs are smaller and lighter than HDDs making their design more flexible. They offer extremely low access times and high throughput, making it effective in high performance areas. There are two types of SSDs. These are the NVMe and SATA SSDs. The NVMe is in the M.2 form factor, while the SATA come as 2.5 inch form factor. Finally, SSDs are more resistant to physical shock and are also more energy efficient. The good thing about SSDs is that they can be used in laptops, desktops as well as servers.